Hi everyone, my name is Leloy. Welcome to Lee's Play. So if you've been following this YouTube channel for quite a while, you know I do a lot of Sims 4 videos. Actually, my most popular is Sims 3 on Mac. However, I actually haven't played The Sims 4 in the past couple of months. I really fell out of love with the game and that's why I wasn't making any videos about it. However, the new pack came out, uh, Dream Home Decorator, and honestly, this is kind of like my dream type of game pack. So obviously I went ahead and bought it. And if this can't get me to play The Sims again, nothing else will. As you can see, I own all the expansion packs, but I'm pretty good of not buying too much of their other DLC. I mean, I really only own Dying Out, big disappointment. Parenthood, which I don't really use to be honest. So now we have Dream Home Decorator. Maybe, just maybe, this will be the game pack. I love Tiny Living, I love Moschino. I don't love Laundry Day. Vintage Glamour, it's all right. And as this movie, Hangout. So the game has went through a lot of changes. I got the new pack, so I said, you know what? Let's do like a new video. Let's do an, an let's do an LP of some sorts. Uh, I'll become an interior designer. We'll do a sim self. Uh, we'll check out some of the new objects and we'll see with the new career is this something that can get me back into the Sims because there's new there's a new personality stuff I haven't even tested yet so uh, let's go fully custom okay I want to check this out this is the new likes and dislikes so hopefully this will give the game a lot more gameplay variety so for myself I love the color black I love red I love gray I love white I love neutrals but I also I'm really into <laughs> yellow purple green <laughs> i'm into all the colors no um i actually like all colors to play through there isn't really a color i don't dislike this is ridiculous i love every color music genre let's have a look i like this i actually like this this is my first time interacting with the new likes and dislikes and i really like this we like s pop i love jazz and like soul music so you can tell a lot about a person from the music that they like. I like anything with a beat to it, so I like classical, go retro. Uh, my sims gonna think they're really musical, and I'm not musical at all. I don't play any instruments. Activity, it's me, I like acting. I like dancing. I like media production, duh. I like programming, a bit of a nerd. What do I not like? I do not like... Do I really not like anything? I don't like singing, I can't sing. <laughs> Honestly, I'm so just modern, so contemporary, mid-century, modern, very typical. I'm going to leave it two points just in case my sim wants to discover any new things about themselves. So let's go ahead and check out what some of the new creative sim options are. So we got these new hairs. Oh, we got new black hair. I forgot we got new black hair. It looks better, but it's still very bright. I would have liked darker hair. I don't like the hair. Uh... We'll go with like a mop, but I'm aware I do not have a mop. But we'll go for the Eco Lifestyle mop and I'll get rid of my Monopoly Man moustache. It'd be great if I could have a Monopoly Man moustache. Where is my five o'clock shadow? Do you know like when you have to look at yourself in the mirror and you're like, do I have that? I don't really have this, but it looks kind of cute, so I'll keep it. Clothes. What's special? What's birthday? Is this for like get to work? It looks like a, an apron. I actually, I really don't like these at all. These are terrible. Let me see if there's anything in the feminine section. <laughs> That's pretty good. We'll go with this, maybe. Yeah, we'll go neutral. Again, just turn off the masculine style option. Pants are pretty cool. I like the pants. That's insane. <laughs> okay, we'll go for these. I'm, I'm kind of actually itch. I am wearing, I even own a pair. Shoes, don't disappoint me. Honestly, I should probably go with that. <laughs> This is really the best outfit I could put together. This is the best outfit, folks, I could put together. And I'm not happy about it. Okay, let's pick some traits. Uh, creative, because we're going to be an interior designer. I'd be a perfectionist. And I'm thinking that we want to make some money. Maybe, see, Kleptomaniac, we could steal from people's houses that we interior decorate. But no, we're going to renovate everything. We're going to be really ambitious. Moschino is like a really good pack for me, I must say. Like Moschino stuff, that's cool. We love a leather jacket, like even like Moschino. Anyone who doesn't like Moschino, what's wrong with you? Moschino's such a good pack. That was a good collaboration. Well, you guys want to see new content, but just in case, we have backup backup outfits for this LP. We'll go for, it's Pride Month, so we'll go for some booty shorts. I've gone for your bloody twink outfit. Fine. Fine, 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 fine. I'm not gay. Uh, the homophobia is real. <laughs> We're going for this. I'm pulling out the letter jack. That, see how good that looks though? 
fine. We're going to use some CC custom content. Look how good that CC looks. I actually have a video on my channel from like a year ago where I got that CC. And I'm still, I still have it in my computer save. Spring, summer, fall, or winter? Uh, we'll go with spring. Hope it doesn't rain. Uh, Samashino. It's been a while since I've played in Samashino. Also, confession time. I've never played. I never played in the poor parts of Samashino. I always played. In Uptown, but just because they're super creative. Oh, we can't even afford to live in the Arts Quarter, see? Bloody inflation. I don't want to live in a family neighborhood. I hate kids. Okay, I can deal with lively neighbors. I can just kill them. Why icons are totally off. It must be, might be my mods. It might be my mods. It might be the mods. Let me just turn them off. I forgot we have hot pot. I should totally put a hot pot in your kitchen. I really like playing in small lots because I can furnish it quickly for this video. So these are the new lights. Seven new lights. I like the saucers, to tell you the truth. I'll just rip this apartment apart. I don't like the layout at all. I feel like I've played in this apartment before because I feel like I've had a lot of heartache over where to put the bedroom. We might have like a really epic bedroom. Ensuite, walk-in closet. We want to test out the new walk-in. So many new beds. Check this out. We must have two, three, four, five, five singles, two doubles. And now we got like five of the bunk variety. That's very nice. A lot of people say that this is more like a really big stuff pack than a game pack. I think it's a game pack because it's really based around interior design and you need, and it, and it, it's very contextual to the fact that for an interior design pack to work, you need a lot of new objects to go in. And I think this, this, this style is very much up my alley. So I could see this becoming like a default kind of, if you want to download my builds, you kind of need to have this pack, uh, you know, get it on sale or something. I think this could be my style, although, I mean, let's wait until we do some gameplay. If the gameplay is terrible, obviously not. We love a nice bed. That's a nice swatch. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, I like the green. We'll go for green. I don't really like brown, and yet I'm here I am. Okay, I'm really happy about these quarter tile bedside tables. I think the ones in The Sims used to be way too big. Because The Sims 4 has quarter tiles, you can see the lines being divided, so why not use them? This is a new door. I like that. Don't like the line on it. Oh, why is the line so noticeable? No, it's it's bloody eco lifestyle all over again. Remember how good this store in eco lifestyle is? And then you flip it around and that thing just sticks out. What does this game have against just giving us a plain bloody door? How do we do the walk-in? So these are drawers. What do the clothes hang on to them? Where are the shoes? The, the clutter shoes. They're not categorized very well. Oh, these are all the new objects. Well, we, a spoiler alert, these are all the new objects. This needs to be categorized properly because we need that. It is also a round one. Okay, that, that, that's pretty good. They let you kind of cheat. I wanted my wardrobe to be epic. Maybe, we'll keep it open. Oh wait, that's for clothes too. There's so many new objects and they're not categorized properly. Does this hold clothes? Okay, where are the clothes at? Come on, you could have given me boots clutter. Let me just take all the objects out. I think that's what you're gonna have to do when you play this pack because I I actually can't I can't tell. And there's so many pieces, which is great. It's not something to complain about. That's dresser. That's a dresser. So clothes can go in there. Clothes can go in there. But I can also go hang clothes here. Okay, so it's very much like what type of piece? Hmm. That's good though. A big complaint when you want to do epic wardrobes is that like, but, but, but Get Famous for example, all, if I had like an epic wardrobe, all, <laughs> like, all they'd all look the same because they'd have the same clutter. But because we can use our own here, I like that quite a bit because now I can actually kind of design this properly. Big mirror comes with like just a straight up wall mirror. I think that could work. Oh, look how that all clips together. Like I was honestly just thinking that if we do this, it's kind of a bit boring. There's so many new objects that I want to, uh, to use. That's cool though, because if these ones are facing backwards, I don't think these will look samey same. This is cool because it doesn't look repetitive. I like that, it doesn't seem repetitive at all. We can even prevent it from being repetitive. On this side, we can put in this like more of chest or drawer situation. You can even slot them in there if you wanted to. See, that looks cool. Nah, I don't want it to be glitchy, but the possibilities, if you had time and patience to hack it properly. Oh, the way these clip, it's actually not a fault of the game. I think it's just how I'm in this particular situation trying to design the damn wardrobe. I'm putting a lot of effort into designing my dream wardrobe. It is Barbie Dream Decorator. 
and then I can put these up here in the shelves. So where would I want to put the shoes? The mirror is confusing me because it makes the room look so much bigger, I can't even tell. Yes, you would have towels here. <laughs> yes! Oh my gosh, yes! Look how custom that looks! It looks great! You know, maybe this is like the more formal stuff that this person never goes to, but your sims are quite tall anyway, so they can reach anything. Aha, uh -huh, that looks cool. Then we can put like a little ottoman, because we got the new ottoman, haven't we? I was an ottoman. You could totally fit there. Uh, uh, uh. Ottoman, you're going in the middle. What do you think? Maybe you just have it like that, though? I just think it needs a separator. It does. We'll go with this, okay? Compromise. <laughs> so that is our fantastic wardrobe for our epic bedroom. Get any new flooring? No new flooring. One new wallpaper. I like the black. We're all about black. MBKHG would love this. Okay, so we got this for our bedroom walls. And so now we just need to do our floors. Game pack, I will say, should have some floors. Okay, we'll go for floors like that. That looks nice. Literally spend 20 minutes designing this wardrobe. This pack is going to be so addictive. I can just talk about renovate people's houses. They're going to look amazing. Again, my sim is ambitious. He's not in it to do a bad job, he will only do a good job. We got some new art, which we like to see. And I believe these all come in different swatches, so we can do like a series of three paintings. I'm gonna say we begin with this, we do that, and we end it off with that. That looks pretty cool, I like that. Good job, Sims team. I was like, I don't like these new rugs, but this one's actually pretty good. If I flip this around, that's the shout. I like that by the window, I like that. Okay, that's the shout brings gold and it brings the gold in the bedroom in and see what I did there so the bathroom my honestly my favorite room in my favorite room in any house now while I'm obsessed with off the ground counters and I kind of like that for a bathroom because I actually have one in real life and it's so practical when it comes to cleaning and of course your sim has maids because it's the sims but in real life having your like stuff off the ground is so easy to clean like you can get a mop and just like quickly like go around that's a, I know it's such a weird thing, but every time I design a bathroom, I'm like, your your furniture must, your all your, you know, your plumbing and stuff needs to be kept off the ground. It's going to be so much easier for you to clean. Oh, the Sims, you do me dirty. Why do you not do a black and white one? No new shower, but we have two new bathtubs. Uh, I'm not a big bad person, if I'm being honest with you. So I'm not going to, I'm going to, I'll put in someone's renovation, but I'm actually just going to put a shower in because that's just how I like to play the game and we're going to go for the one from Snowy Escape although you can substitute it yourself. It's very clinical. I think I need to change this up a little bit. It's prison like. Prison the bathroom. It's been a while since I've played The Sims. My interior design skills are just not what they used to be. Yeah maybe. Might need, might need a plant or like a piece of art or something. Let me just get any new plants come with the pack. Bring that over. Hang that there. Sure. Sure, sure, sure. We'll go with this. Bathroom. Meh. Bedroom's awesome. I put all the effort in here. This is our main living space. I have a, it's, it's, you know, it's, it's ready to go. So I, I just want to see this damn kitchen. I'm so excited to have a bloody new kitchen after all this time. Oh, these new cabinets. I put that there. Now, what color kitchen have I always wanted? I think. That's good. Okay. I like that. That's, that's what we're going for. That's gonna look good in community lots too, by the way. I was just thinking about that. Okay, we need a fridge. <laughs> you know, what's taking the Sims community by storm is the new stoves and the fact that we have the the, um, the uh, induction hobs so that you can separate them from the actual oven. But in terms of our cabinetry, I'm glad they match. I'm glad they fit. This is what the kitchen's going to look like. I like the fact that it can be a different color. I like that a lot. It's very dark appliances. So I think we go for that in like a nice white sink in the middle. And then we can finally get our bloody shelves. We might just do something like that to make it look a bit different. Like even though if they don't fit perfectly, you can still kind of do it. That's my kitchen. Haha, see it doesn't look, it doesn't look same, same. This is the best of the bad bunch. I don't think we have enough room for a dining table. I think we're gonna have to go for the bar stools because we need to put a bloody couch in. And I want to use the new sectional sofa. Damn it. <laughs> oh, this new sectional sofa looks great. We've got like a, a chaise lounge. We've got these sectionals. Aha. And these come like in pieces, right? Like it comes. Oh, it's so nice. We might have to just have a two-seater. This might be what we have to do. It looks, that's tight. Unless we go for like two seats only. We might have to do something like that. 
it's a bachelor pad that's that's what we're going for now like i like the flexibility like this this is a scenario where it's good that we have sectionals because we can really design how the couch is going to work oh even these have sectionals brilliant you can totally do something like that sims team this is your way forward in life how does scooting work if sectionals don't clip together i like the yellow the yellow is super cool and sure my sim is an interior designer duh like I guess sometimes when you design these houses you try to design them to be kind of very general purpose but then you're like oh yeah, i forgot there's there's a sims actually interior designer so of course we'll have to use this oh we did get a new chair though got a new yeah that's perfect we might make that red i like that and then we got a brand new gold laptop didn't we i think we got a brand new gold laptop where's the gold one so nice how do i oh wow after all these months i still remember that bloody cheat do you know like when i was playing the sims constantly i'd still have to google that freaking cheat every bloody day gold laptop it is oh that's looking super cool also in gold I want all the gold yes you can have a gold llama this is really the only one we can afford whoa what's this closed storage space how did i not see you before how did i not see this before oh so i see like some pieces really slot in but some don't Mm, nope not the right one i saw someone who was able to make them all move together so i must be using the wrong piece i never really put curtains in my builds if i'm being honest which is it's funny that uh i'm actually putting curtains in my build i need to decide what walls i'm going for before i can decide on what curtain what color curtains to use i need to figure out how to make this cabinet thing so how does because i saw someone make the cabinet and they all the people all the pieces moved. <laughs> all the pieces moved. So it's it's possible. I think this might be an abomination if I'm being honest. This is awful. I do like this though, by the way. I know it sounds like it could be negative. Actually, I really like this. But I think overall, like you kind of need something like this for it to look properly nice. I don't think the way I'm doing it looks that good. So I might just go for like a nice little TV kind of cabinet. So this is our living space. There wasn't really enough room for a dining table. I mean, you could, if you had tiny living, I think you could probably put one there. We'll start off with swatches of what we're going to put on the actual wall. I like yellow and yellows. I picked yellow was a color that my sim likes. So we're going to actually, it's going to be a great test for us almost because like he's got the golden yellow laptop. He's got yellow walls. This is probably one of the best kitchens I've ever seen. It's so simple. I like red, so. I think that looked nice over the kitchen. I like the red. The red's hot. Brings it, it ties in the couch. <laughs> that's the look. That's that's, oh, that's so good. Guys, the swatches of the tops of the cabinets actually match, it matches the countertops. I don't think the eyes needs to match. I was nervous about this pack. I mean, at least the build by so far. So good. I want my hot pot. I forgot that the hot pot was there. Uh, hot pot's a really good item. Um, you can feed a whole family with this and it fits much anywhere like what would you normally your sims can't chop there so put your hot pot on it fine 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 there we go maybe a bookcase but i don't think i actually want this bookcase i know you, i know that would be the obvious thing to go for is just this rustic one it goes on this wall i don't think i want a rug i was gonna put a rug in but i don't think i want one we do want a backsplash yes i just want something that's like inconspicuous like Pin and plain. You're gonna be sitting super close to the TV. Oh no, the console is like can really fit into that. This is the apartment. I'm done now. I will put this on the galleries. Yeah, 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 yeah. So it's on the gallery now. And we are all set to finally play the game. I put a lot of effort into this bloody apartment. It looks good though, I'm happy with it. So we go in and we need to start our new dream and decorate our life so we're going to go on our new golden laptop apple please give us a new golden MacBook pro next week when you guys do your new keynote event i would like one career find a job interior decorator and now we need to find a gig so this is very much like get famous we have a room renovation in the delgado household like cia classic interior artisans that's hilarious this is the bedroom i i'm such a huge fan of this pack but look how good the wardrobe looks nice entryway oh this is so good like it's just simple the drawers are simple it's just what i wanted the semi-shuna looks so bleak today 
And then this is our living area with some extra lighting put in. So whatever his sim is for LP, uh, he immediately is gonna go and find himself a man. So the first place we're gonna check, it's, it's daytime, so we're gonna go to the gym and see if we can find hunks here that we can uh, start a little relationship with. It's gonna be a great way to test out the sim's likes and dislikes as I find more about them. So let's see if there's anyone nice here at the gym. Now I know who that person is on the treadmill and we do not like him. That's the guy from Eco Lifestyle, that stinky guy. I, I can tell from his hair. Because it's bloody Knox Greenberg, we're staying away from him. Oh, he's a heartbreaker. Isn't he like in a relationship with someone? Nope, Knox, we're not doing it. We're not that desperate. Off to the bar. No, 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 we're gonna find someone really sophisticated. Let's go to the spark gallery. Oh, who is this guy? Let's do it. Be such a home wrecker. Look at us running over to be a home wrecker. We're gonna get a bit more and more. Got all this money. His vast empire. Poor Bella won't know better. Bookworm. We have a bookshop in our house. Perfect. Um. Music. We're going straight in. We're asking if he's single, but we knew he was married to Bella. I'm gonna ask about his parents. Oh no! Come on, more, some more. Midlife crisis. I always thought more and more was like in the business career. Like I always thought he was like a Chandler Bing character. He looks colour grey. Ask about taste and decor, please, like the modern stuff. Mortimer, do you not know what house you live in? Screw it, Mortimer. Bally can have you. Okay, we're on the hunt for a man until our job starts tomorrow. So, to the dark, to the nightclubs. No, what, we might find a cute person at a coffee shop. Okay, now we're talking. We got ta- oh, he might be interested. Come on, Marcus. Well, I don't like Claire Brian either, so that's perfect. He likes mid-century. Oh, my apartment's right up there. I think I played The Sims when they introduced sentiments. That was just something. Gym trainer at the fitness place. I hate though that when they join your family, they become unemployed. Are you single? Yes, he's single. Okay, now compliment. Get in there. Oh, I'll confess attraction. Yes. This gonna okay. This gonna sound weird, but a big problem I have with The Sims 4 is that you aren't rewarded by your purchases, which you think you should be. Like, if you owned a pet pack, for example, do you not find it weird that in the entire, your entire universe of your save file, pets really don't exist in any world besides Brindleton Bay, because that's part of the pet pack. But like, no one in Willow Creek or, you know, the Sandy World or Island Living owns a pet. Like, they've never seen a dog or a cat before in their life. The base game worlds and the worlds from previous packs would acknowledge the changes have happened. The Sims 1, if you had Hot Date, um, if you went to a disco in Hot Date, there'd be like a dance floor, but the object, the dance floor object was from the party. So it was pretty simple. If you had house party installed, it would put the object in the disco on the floor. And if it didn't, I think there was just like some wood floor underneath that looked like a disco floor. So for people who didn't have the house party pack, it was like just a square, like it was a few squares that like obviously that's where people dance. But if you had house party, you'd have the full on dance floor. And we did the Sims 3 Let's Play. When I did the city one, the Sims 3 Nightlife, it recognized I had ambitions because I put the fire station into the world. And like that's something so simple. Oh look at Bjorn, he's coming for me again. I can't make this up. Joaquin is kind of cute. Maybe we should go Joaquin. Let's dance with Joaquin. Why does Bjorn... I'm bored. He was bored because he didn't have the dancing skill, but once he got it, he likes it. And like, my hobby was like, this is good. This is nice. I like this quite a bit. This is obviously the new improvements they made. Oh, the Sims 4. Let's play some video games on your new sectional sofa. I keep forgetting that you can set the different colors of lights. I wish you could do this in Build By. Because sometimes, like, when you do a house, I like warm lights in general. So. I might do the same for even this one. It might be a bit much, but I like the aura it's giving off. We can't go on a date, unfortunately, because I have to go to bloody work. This is huge. Oh my god, what are you going to ask me to do an interior designer? <laughs> the most glaring omission of the game not recognizing what you bought is the pets. It's super weird that the only world where Sims have pets is Brindleton Bay. And like in every other world, it's like animals do not exist here. So, friendly introduction. I don't need to go to college. That's just for the interior design. Right, 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 right. So we're... She likes orange. Purple. Well, Justin, what do you like? This is the house that we have to now renovate. <laughs> it's huge. Where do we want to renovate? See, that matches the style of this house. So... Well, it's not what they want, because they're into purple, orange, and... Um... Their, their wardrobe situation is interesting, to say at least. So how do we renovate the bedroom? I feel like there's something we can actually renovate. 
Like I could we renovate down? Nah, we know what she likes. I don't want to renovate the kids' room because we didn't find out what the kid liked. Oh, the husband's just gonna have to get rid of it. The husband's gonna have to get rid of it. So let's take the before photo. My sim. Did he just say he was terrible at photography? He was not good at it. <laughs> it's a big part of your job as interior designer. We're gonna totally do a nice job on this. This is sad. I hate the curtains alone because we're gonna change those up so much. We're not going to move the fireplace. Is, okay, is this the type of house that has actual thing built? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so we're not going to move the fireplace. Like, we're going to do interior design rules. No new floor tiles are allowed. I'm going to make sure I turn off move objects. I kind of want to use all my packs because I think that's going to be realistic to how we don't, we're going to play this day to day. It's, it's a boring bedroom. It's it's a dead bedroom, okay? So I want something bold. And this thing is sticking out. We're not able to make new walls or anything okay that's good because i hated everything about that can i build new walls I can remove walls but not add any oh no oh, this is the bug that people were talking about uh -oh. okay 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 it's fine not to worry not to worry obviously we're going for a feature wall like in europe our houses are built out of brick but in america like you build your bloody houses out of wood i don't even know how they stay up i'm actually drawn to this we're going to be super bold. This is what we're going to get. As an interior designer, we're going to have a reputation in Sim World. Like, we're just going to take the world by sleep. You know what I mean? These are going to be the hint to what we put. Yeah, like, this should be, this should be nice. Like, I think we need to be respectful to what the architects built in this house. Because that's how seriously we're taking this build. So, we have 3,800 left. It's coming to the point now in the Sims 4 have to use the filters because there's a lot of objects which is good though the woman's side will be bigger so what's supposed to go on the other one so i think it's tall or medium like, that's perfect because it's kind of open like see the way there's a like, glass there it's kind of what i was looking for but this bloody thing won't work because it's rounded so that's going to be his side and then for her side I like that. it's like her professional workwear like in the middle and these are like her blouses and dresses for work. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. That's cool. And then we'll do the same for over here. Very old fashioned. So that's our built in wardrobe. I really, really like that. So this is actually base game. I mean, I know the, the bed doesn't match the wardrobe, but like, what can we do? No, I think we need a mission style one. Um, I actually like this quite a bit. Uh, I think the feature wall is not going to work out. I think we're going to have to just the future wall is not working out. <laughs> okay, the one from Seasons. Seasons, you have to come true for us one more time. That's kind of nice. That's luxurious. And actually, this will match in perfectly because this is not green. Oh, that's bugged, but I know, I know what they're getting at. And what I'm thinking for over here is a shade lounge. And then put some clutter on it. I could do like a nice little spread, as you see like in those interior design shows. Perfect, so this is, I, I can't spend anymore. I don't want to ruin the house. Like, I think that's plenty done a lot with this space. I am proud of what we created in this video today for the bedroom. Oh, I'm better save this. Okay, I'm happy enough with this. Yep, we removed a wall that might have not been allowed but it was a bug but we will not talk about it. I love the new corner sofa thing we did. And look, we even gave you a bloody desk. Yeah. I think this turned out well. I mean, I Sure, I was able to remove a wall I wasn't able to, but I'm glad I was able to remove the wall because it's so much better. Oh, that clipped into the curtain. I'm happy with this, okay guys? This is a renovation. I stayed true to what the house is. Like, it's a mansion, it's luxurious. It looks happy. That's good. That's a hug. You are pink and purple. Pink, purple, and orange. It's all her. It's all her. Oh, but we did our job. We got 648 and our professional reputation improved significantly. Yay. We got a promotion. And we got some interior design magazines. They all have the same budget, which I think is super interesting. Yes, my sims are creative. He loves the interior decorate. This is a total vibe, okay? Let me know in the comments down below if you like the apartment I made. I like it. Here we are. We're in Mount Com Reppy. Oh, I didn't realize that I'm going to be in Samishuna. 
Okay, cool. Friendly introduction. Because we're very low cash. Talk about previous projects. So we love to hear it. Ask to see a mood board. And that's the interest board. Now let's bring up the work. Is she the only homeowner? We need to make sure everybody in this damn house likes what we do with the place. No, why is a kid inviting me to join a group? Doesn't like photography. Well, that's just bloody doesn't help us in the slightest. Huge difference between this. This is a smaller house, yet they still have a lot of money to spend. This is going to be tricky, like what to renovate. Um, and it's only one room. That's going to be interesting because there's not many Japanese and I want to stay faithful to the fact that it's an oriental room. This doesn't help us at all. It likes the colour grey, doesn't like photography. Maybe we could just move up the garden. Like what's a mischievous item? You know? I mean, there's only so much I can do with this room. This one has nothing in it but like towels. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's get decorating once more. I guess it's a good opportunity to influence more Asian teams that maybe came with stuff from like Samai Shuno. Okay, I have an idea. Yeah, yeah, I have an idea. I say we do this. Oh, here we go. Eco self. Come to the rescue once more. I like this. I like this quite a bit. Even though it's cheaper, that works pretty damn well. I think we follow on the end. Yes. This is the look. This is the vibe. I don't think this is going to go with the house, but we can use another one. And a new chaise lounge. Uh, I use this one in my own home, so we'll go for this one. And I want to have a lot of fun with the sectionals. We're going to do like a really fun sectional. I don't think a chaise lounge is going to... I don't think this is going to suit. I think we just go full on out with the sectional. I would have actually have liked that by itself without the other corner on it. Like, mm. I, don't, I don't know if we're supposed to be able to move doors in interior design. Jobs only, but here we are. Symmetry doesn't work the same way anymore. Because we now have, we can, we, can, we can do corners now. But now we can move this back a little bit. Some breathing space. Doesn't tie in though with any of the other wood. I hope this comes in a bright swatch. Oh yeah, we changed the painting frame. Is that something that you look at a renovation show? We made it more to your liking. I don't hate that. And it's grey. So she'll love it. I hate that light with a passion. I think we'll go for the one from City Living. I think I'd love another plant. And one did come with Zoe Escape. We're going to use that one I declined for my apartment. This one will go perfect. Like 100% right there. I wasn't sure what I was going to put there. But I think greenery. Holy crap, when did the mirrors go from like small to hideously big? Oh, we have to use, these are the ones though that when you click on them, they'll automatically take off their, their shoes. So we kind of have to go for these for a reason. I don't mind that though. Put a new front door in if I could. But I'm trying to be like realistic if we're going to do like a renovation, you know? I'm afraid to put art in, in case I don't like art. So nothing for Moschino stuff. <laughs> So maybe a computer, because I like clownery. Oh, I wish this bloody desk from Parenthood actually went into the back of the wall, because it's perfectly like laptop sized. And yet here we are. I'm afraid to put art into the bloody building in case they don't like it. I sneak another plant on top now. It's grey. Okay. Perfect. Uh, does this come in grey? Ugh, the perfectionist in me. Oh, screw it. Uh, it's called a it's a lot. Three. Four. Got it. I'm just so excited. I never got to see the before and afters. I didn't do the slideshow. This is great too, Missy. Yes, love hearts. We love to see it. Oh my god, the kids judging me? Oh god, what does the kid think? I was for final. Oh my gosh, the little kid likes it. Yay! Let's get the husband or a domestic partner. Todd's gonna get a full sweep. Okay, little kid, what do you think? She liked it. Always just three out of four. Aw. Well, our professional reputation improved significantly, so I guess we're done here. We made our money. Time to go home. The money stayed the same, 648. Was not that the same as my first promote, my first entry level job? Oh no, the pay was like, I got a bonus. Right, right, right. I like though the house doesn't revert back, the changes are permanent and that's why I like to see it. That's why I think it's going to be like a nice really good full career for one of your sims to take on because you can really change the world. Oh I actually forgot to put a door into my bloody bedroom. 
That's so funny. How did I miss? I didn't put a door into my bloody bedroom. Oh, it was already made. Can we not? Um, it's cute though. Check this out. Romantic date in the city, nighttime, fashion apartment, rather some hot pot. I really want a gold MacBook Pro. Apple, please announce one at your keynote next week. So he's non committal, hates fitness, but works as a gym trainer. This guy sounds like an absolute winner. Okay, now it's time to put the moves on Marcus. Oh no, he's. he's oh no, he's, he's leaving. No. Oh, Marcus said no thank you. He literally ate our food and went for the hills. What? Oh, he's washing in the bathroom sink. Oh, it's good old days of the Sims writing problems. I think I'm going to leave it off here though. Thank you so much for watching. Do my Sims 4 Dream House Makeover at LP. I don't know if I'll do part two. If this gets views and you guys want to see it, definitely drop a comment down below and I'll do a part two. But hopefully this gives you a taste of what the pack has to offer.